And I think we should be clearer. And I can't bear Michael Gove, and I don't trust anything he says. But I know for a fact, as a Muslim journalist, there is a problem in some of these schools. There is a problem of self-exclusion, of being taught. I had an email just yesterday from a young boy who is gay and in one of these schools. And the letter made me weep. Because he can't he, express... He's so in a, frightened. Right. Mm. He is so, he's threatening to kill himself. <clears throat> then when he wrote the letter, he says, I am so scared, I'm, I, I, you know, I think I'm going to die. We have to think about the particularities of each of these problems. No, and where the Muslims are right in saying, we're not all terrorists, nor are we all extremists. You know, we need to be clearer. And also, but also, you, uh, you know, it's a basic principle of British law. You don't criminalise people for what they think. Bill, they might yeah. think things that you absolutely hate, but people are allowed to do that. Then you engage them in an argument. It's a very different thing from what you do about people who commit acts that are extreme. Exactly. Although in this particular...